so welcome to another episode of Come Thrifting With Me. Uh, since I last did a video, I kind of chopped a lot of my hair off because it started falling out a bunch after having a baby and she just yanks it. So I just thought I'd try out something new. I'm kind of into it. It's pretty low maintenance so I can just like air dry it and go. And the little one's back there <laughs> in a car seat and will come with us. I should really rename this to like Come Thrifting With Harriet and I. That's what we're gonna do today. We're at the Goodwill. If you're local, I'm at the Goodwill in Chanhassen, or Chanhappenin. And I need some stuff for fall. So I'm looking for stuff for my fall kind of like capsule wardrobe and maybe a little bit for Harriet's fall capsule wardrobe too. <laughs> Not that I do like a crazy capsule for her or anything like that, but she's got like kind of a small supply of clothes. So kind of like a capsule. So let's go on. So what I need from here are probably like some tops. Mostly, I don't really need any bottoms for fall, but some tops, just like really simple, maybe t-shirts, um, tank tops, and sweaters. I'm so sick of the sweaters that I wore all throughout my pregnancy, so I got, I got rid of them. <laughs> Alright, I've been here all of like five minutes and I already have found a bunch of stuff, in, in, including an Ellen Fisher, like cardigan, so we'll see how that goes. That looks pretty cool, but different. So yeah, a bunch of like basic neutral dig in it. And she's just super chill like angel baby right now. <laughs> Alright, we're in the fitting room. I got like a mega stack of things to try on. See what I want to keep and not. And it's kind of tight quarters in here. <laughs> Alright, we're going to start with t-shirts. And I already don't like this one. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like, I don't know, something you work, wear as like a service worker at like a restaurant or something. But I thought maybe the button down could look cute, but this is a no. T-shirt number two, it's like a kind of like burnt maroon color. I don't think this red wall is doing anything for these clothes that I'm trying on. But I really like this. It's really soft. And I'm going to keep it. This one is a yes. All the shirts I got are like really basic. So this is just like an olive green one. Has like a pocket <laughs> strategically placed like under my boob it kind of looks like. But I think I'm still into it. Might still get it. Can't tell if this makes my like one boob look saggy or not. <laughs> but I don't know. It's a good basic. It will do perfect for this fall. This one is a yes. Alright, so this is not super flattering like this, but I like the um, pattern of this kind of like gray like this. And I'm pretty sure it's a men's small, not a women's small. But this is what I would do different in styling it. Ready? Tuck it in and then roll up the sleeves and it's like cute now. I'm digging it. This one is also a yes. Uh oh. <laughs> you doing some dirty business in that diaper, Harry? I heard that. So I found this one in the like boy small section, and I'm probably gonna get this solely because it's like football season starting. I think on the Sunday, and I have no Vikings gear. Not that I'm like a huge sports fan, but I like to uh, participate in the festivities. So again, I would just tuck this in, and then roll up the sleeves. And then we're good to go. So this one is a yes. <laughs> Probably won't fall into my capsule wardrobe, but you know, you gotta like represent. All right, so I put one of the shirts, t-shirts on again. And this is that Ellen Fisher cardigan. I don't really know if I like this like point. It feels very like dated and a little too mom with like my mom haircut now. So I'm gonna have to pass on this. So no. So this cardigan from American Eagle has potential, but like why are the arms so aggressively long? And see where the shoulder weird drop thing is? I don't know. This one's unknown. So I'm a sucker for like sweaters like this. <laughs> and I saw this one and I thought it was really cute, but it is way too big on me. I need like three sizes smaller. But it's still super cute. It would be for definitely like the end of fall when it's turning into like straight up winter here. It's got potential, but I'm feeling a little too like, I don't know. I got my mom jeans on, I got my mom haircut on, and is this too like, earth mom? 
Alright, second to last thing. I'm super into this. The texture on this sweater is super cool. If I can kind of get a better shot of it here. I know it's like bubbly. <laughs> so I like how that has like this cool texture here. The arms are like just simple. And then look at there's like buttons in the back. I didn't see that when I like took off the rack when I just put it on. I'm into this. I like this a lot. Love the back up, back button up detail. Big yes. Okay, so this is the last one. I don't know if these things are like cool anymore. It's like that crazy furry, I don't know, material. But this thing is so soft and it's so comfy. I feel like I really like it and I'm going to get it. <laughs> See, this is like the weird texture of it, but I think I'm like super into it. I don't know. I just feel like it's kind of cute. So let's come home with me too. I really like the color. I feel like it'll go good with light jeans and like these colored type of shoes for fall. All right, that concludes the things I think I'm gonna get for clothes at the thrift store. But I did see a really cute ottoman out there that I know is from Target because Goodwill donates, or Target donates a handful of stuff to like Goodwill in Minnesota because Target's headquarters here. And I think I'm gonna get one of those because they're real cute and they're like 30 bucks. Contact to the register, please. Contact to the register, thank you. These are the no-go's. This is the ottoman. Super cute. 30 bucks. All right, that uh, concludes this episode of Come Thrifting with me and Harriet. <laughs> I also got, in addition to that um, ottoman, is this cute planter. It's kind of like a really soft, pastel y, almost like minty green. So, yeah. Let's say I got some stuff for fall, which is really awesome. I got a lot of t-shirts, but I, it's really nice to layer, in my opinion. Uh, so yeah, that's about it. I'm gonna get this little squealy one home and call it a night. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. So it's the next day, and Harriet's sleeping in the other room. I'm in her room right now, and Joel's mowing the lawn, so it's a little loud in the background, but. I went uh, thrifting again today with my sister, but more to like a consignment store. It's called New Look, like N-U Look in South Minneapolis. And I actually found a bunch of really cute stuff. So I'm feeling like I'm pretty well prepared for fall. And most of the stuff I got was all secondhand, which is awesome. So let me show you what I got. So I found some Sorrel, Sorrel, I never know how to say this, boots. I have been, needing these boots for like forever i don't know how i live in minnesota and don't own these but they're really expensive like um brand new and these i got secondhand for like 32 dollars and they are literally like new and they are waterproof which is awesome and they're really warm perfect for more like winter i guess um here in minnesota but still good and then this is what I got. It's a mix of things for myself and Harriet. So I kind of have gotten like three cream or white sweaters in two days. Maybe I should just try these on and I can show you. And then I'll show you Harriet's little bundle at the end. So I'm super excited about this coat. It's coming off a bit more like burnt red in the video, but it's like that um, cyan sienna so something color let's see if i can get a better this is coming off like definitely more burnt or like red like a light red in this video but it's more like that burnt brown red color like that cyan cyan i don't know how you say it but it's a really cute coat that i think i will get a ton of use out of come this fall and it's like light and relaxed and cute and has like a little drawstring thing here so yeah I'm into this thing so I found this American Apparel uh, sweater and what I really like about it is it's like cropped a because I wear more high-waisted jeans and I feel like it's flattering on me but B I have always looked for like a sweater type of thing that would look good with um, like a dress or like a skirt 
that you can actually tuck in and it not be like crazy bulky and not look like it should be paired with a skirt. So I'm really into this. It's kind of like a cream color, just that like standard knit to it. And it's cropped so it'll look great with like um, high-waisted jeans or like a skirt. So I had to buy this <laughs> other cream knit sweater because this one is like, has that like fisherman vibe. But the real reason is I got Harriet this from Gap, uh, I don't know, kind of a while ago now. And then we can match on our cute sweaters. I mean, pretty much like a life goal for me is to like always match Harriet, so double win. So that's all I got for myself from the store, but I'm feeling really good. Like they're good pieces that will integrate well into my like, existing wardrobe and stuff. So now I'll show you the cute pieces I got Harriet. I got her these really cute pants. It's kind of like a sagey green color, which I think are very cute and will work in the winter and fall and stuff. And then this really simple, adorable gray little dress, which I also think is super adorable and cute and can be layered with things like this cute Gap cardigan that I got her also. Baby clothes are just so much fun. And it's so much fun to buy them secondhand because they grow out of them so dang fast. And then lastly, I got her this really cute uh, sweater. I think this is like an H&M baby sweater. But I love the little like striped neck detail and I feel like it'll look really cute with these kind of sage pants and stuff. So yeah, that's like everything I got from the thrift store in the last like two days or so. Um, yeah, now it's like actually the end of the video. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you actually in the next one.